Hello, I am the fan and this is Deus Ex. In this series I will play through the director's cut of Deus Ex Human Revolution. But before we begin, there's a few things we need to go through. First, there has been a period of time between my actually playing the game and doing the live commentary and the time I edit these videos together. As I was playing the game, I thought I would push the files onto YouTube as they came without editing, but that plan changed along the way as you may have noticed. Therefore, whenever during the gameplay footage I mention episode lengths or something like that, just ignore that. Second, one of the reasons I decided to edit the footage is the amount of loading screens and such. I have edited most of them out and I'm trying to leave only the relevant stuff with the actual gameplay and the plot stuff. Some loading screens which, over which I say something important I might leave, but mostly I'm gonna delete them as we go along. This is a long game, so they would really add up otherwise. Third, when I started recording this, I had already finished the game once on the Xbox 360. However, this time uh, we are on the PC, even though I do use the Xbox controller. Also, this time the Missing Link DLC chapter is included, which was not on my original Xbox game disc, so that section I will be encountering for the first time. Fourth, this is a mature game with mature themes, and I will also be using mature language in the commentary. You have been warned. Also, since this is a complete playthrough, there will be spoilers. Again, you have been warned. And finally, as you can see, I am starting the game on the easiest difficulty, and that is because I am a wimp. I admit it. But now, I will leave you in the capable hands of me in the past. Well, here we go. satellites are ours when we need them. A few weeks of discomfort and the public will be primed for our recall. And the clinics? We control them most of it. They will do as we say. I still think we should wait for the referendum. We can't afford to wait. America's science board convenes next month. But the mood among the delegates is shifting. I'm positive that given more time... No. By going public with this discovery, Seraph is forcing our hand. The world will not change overnight just because David Seraph will it. Besides, we can do nothing until our biochip is ready. I thought you said you were close. Finding the correct nerve interface has proven more challenging than anticipated. Fortunately, thanks to David, I now know where to look. This newscaster is straight out of the Hunger Games. Gathering in front of the Capitol. Most are demanding that Congress severely restrict efforts to alter the human body's abilities. This in response to claims made by biotechnology expert David Seraph that his firm may have discovered a way to make human controlled evolution available to all. Seraph Industries researchers are sent to arrive in Washington tomorrow to defend their way. But for tonight, this is Eliza Kassam reporting to you live. And here's Adam. With all due respect, Major, Hero. I'll okay. expect two security details waiting for us on the tarmac. No, we won't be going through the terminal, it's too exposed. Yes. I'm glad you understand. Good night, idiot. Something wrong? No, not for me it isn't. But you keep pulling on that necklace, Dr. Reed, and you're gonna break it. Come on, Meg. You've defended your research before. That was different. 
then it was all just theories. But this discovery, Adam, it's big. Kepler big. Rosetta Stone big. So, what's the problem? They'll want to know how I found it. Begging. We're leaving for DC and... Adam, you're there. Good, good. You need something, boss? Yeah. I want to go over your security plans for Washington before we leave. You and your team ready to go, Megan? Almost, David. We're just rechecking data. Well, make it snappy. We have to actually be in Washington before you can dazzle all those federally appointed know-it-alls. I hate it when he does that. Come on, I'll walk you part way. And we almost have... Actually, we can walk in this part. <laughs> I know we can't walk in the next part, so let's just... Well, there's no no user interface, so can't really do anything. I press X, and now I can't walk by myself. I'm on rails. I can, however, move my head. What did you mean back there, Meg? About how you found it? Nothing. It's just my nerves talking. There's something I should know about this place, about Sarif. Megan! Hold on. We're still getting biochemical fluctuations across the artificial flow cells. Okay. But the increased neuropeptides coming from the PDOT cluster could be throwing off your calibrations. Right. I'll double check that. I can't believe you were asking about David. You've been here long enough to know of Eric. You wouldn't be avoiding me, would you? I wouldn't dream of it, Dr. Reed. I think I know why Declan's readings are off. Two neuropeptides? I'm thinking the glial tissue breakdown we noticed after splicing in the compressive protein might be the cause. If we had a better cytometer... You might get a more accurate reading than this. Is I'll ask That's David to consider this. Well, if he orders one from Page Industries, maybe they'll throw in another cappuccino maker. You overthink everything, Adam. The work we're doing is good. We're helping people overcome their physical limits. I would probably uh, put the dialogue volume up a little bit here, but as you can see, I can only get this instead of the start menu, and I can only click resume, so... Yeah, deal so with it. clients seem to be DOD. You're doing good. It's not all There's another hour to go. We work with teachers, doctors, construction workers. <laughs> Damn it! Watch it, Eddie! Those boxes are worth more than your salary! Sorry, sorry. Nia, you almost ready? Washington? Huh. Sassy black lady. Ah, Dr. Reed. This is General O'Neill. Dr. Sevchenko was telling me you've made progress on the Typhoon. Yes, thanks to Vasily, actually. As I was saying, sir, the Typhoon uses a modified combat chassis like the one I'm wearing. But I've improved its design using shaped microcharges to propel the steel balls. And the backblast problem? Solved through kinetic bleeders in the altar. Here, watch. Go ahead. Yes, we will get to play with that later. I'm afraid I have to run, but Vasily has all the details, General. Of course. You still have some work to do. You're right. The teacher would just love having one of those things. You're missing the point. Defense contracts keep us afloat, but neural augmentations that make you think faster react quicker. They can really improve a life, everybody's lives. David's talked about it for years. He is a talker. He's a good man. Admit it, Adam. A part of you likes him. Oh, I like everyone, Dr. Reed. Yeah, right. Oh no, we can't control the camera. Uh... Okay, we're back. How far are you going? Diane's office. I forgot to leave her a key so she can lock Hubert. He's got big, you know keeps knocking over all my plans. Did you destroy that base yet? I moved it. And I fenced it in the yard. Like you always said you were going to. Yeah. Never got around to that. <laughs> Sorry. Me too. About a lot of things. Adam, I... There's something I... This Please. guy is a prick. Richard. And his name is Richard. So are we all ready for the trip? There's Farida. I'd better hurry. See you at the helipad, Adam. Sure. Did I uh, interrupt 
himself named Jensen. You fix that firewall yet? You don't fix an entire firewall. You find a loophole and plug it. Then did you plug it? Yes, I did. Want to know how? Oh, wait, I forgot. X Oh, wait, we need exposition. X SWAT, and you'd be surprised. Seraph has to see you too. Athena. She wants me to show her how to track our scientist implanted locator devices. In case your security plans in Washington don't measure up. They will. Gentlemen, how wonderful to see you both. Go right in, Adam. This way. This is the newest of encrypted GPL trackers. GPL? New public license? What? Should that not be TPS? No. Okay, whatever. Senators love this guy, Lyle. The hearings will go much smoother with him there. Big day for us tomorrow. Everything in place? Yes, sir. Capitol Police will escort us to the Hill, and then Federal Protection Services takes over. Good, good. How's our girl holding up? She's nervous. All she has to do is show him her research. She explained it to you? Not really into the whole science thing, boss. It's incredible. All those purists out there accusing us of tampering with the natural order. When all Megan's done is figure out how to unlock the potential that exists within our own DNA. It's safer and easier than anything you, Darrow, ever did. Environmental malfunction. Laboratory subsection 6. All lab chiefs, please report. All here. right, shit's about We've to get real. Any chances. Not tonight. Use my elevator to get down there. You know the code? Yeah, 0451. Let me know what you find. Athena, get someone to shut off the damn racket. Yes, sir. Uh, so, yeah. Let's see. Uh, can I use my keyboard here? Oh, four, five, one. Oh my god, I can. That's awesome. Yes, augmented play. I did use. I just used my number pad to enter the Creature. numbers there. Just Where's May? She reported yet? Her GPL implant shows her moving through the microchem labs. I think she's running. Damn it. Must have been a serious equipment failure. Can you get eyes on her? I'm trying, but the IntelliCams aren't responding. There's interference coming from somewhere. Find out what's happening, Jensen. Hurry! Actually, okay, I can't save the game here. Okay. Richard! Alright, we Richard. got a gun. So, tutorial available. I'm gonna just take Before a look at you this. can do anything, you must be able to get around. The first move you'll want to learn is the crouch. Okay, anything else? It will allow you to get into small spaces such as air vents, or to hide behind low objects so you can move about unnoticed. Okay. Jumping on objects or ladders okay, is essential jumps. for getting to those hard to reach places. Wow, nice. Sometimes going high or low is not enough. Sometimes you just need to go okay, fast. It'll be for running. Right. You'll only be able to sprint for a few seconds at a time, though, so use it wisely. Jesus Christ, Jensen. I mean, I know I am fat, and even I can run for longer than that. We okay. Let's see. How many guys do we need to kill? Okay. Can I? No, I can't, of course not. Okay, let's see. Okay, there's some serious shit going down here in the laboratories. I think this is actually where we just... Or is this could be where we came through, I don't know. Okay. Holy shit. What the fuck is that? Oh! Ah, that's not nice. We could do this, but yeah, this won't do anything. Go in here. Moving objects. Okay, let's see. Some objects in the environment can be picked up and moved. Yeah, there's Use them to create paths to inaccessible areas. Or as portable cover during a firefight. Portable cover. Actually, the video was taken with a keyboard, as you can see. If need be. Okay. 
Is there anything interesting here? Probably not, since this is a tutorial level. Let's take this shit. Throw the, throw the fuck over there. Okay. Yay. No, that's nothing. Probably did, would, shouldn't need to check shit on this level yet, since the game hasn't really started. Okay, so we're on this side now. Okay. Combat tutorial, I think we're gonna get to shoot. Probably. When the lead starts to fly, it's wise to take cover. This will protect you from bullets and explosives. To shoot, peek out from behind your cover spot, either to the side or from above. Then take aim and fire. Whenever possible, use cover when moving around. Line of sight is important. And by keeping behind cover... Yeah, 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 yeah. So, if I want cover, I can... Yes, okay. That's good. Okay, yeah, it works. Let's go here. Okay. You also notice that we actually go to a third person camera view while I'm in cover, which is nice. I like it. Probably allows... Is this, the, this where we're going? Yes, okay. Cover. No, ah, there's a guy in there, I think. No! no not like that. Shit. Wow, there's a lot of recoil here. Is that guy dead? I think he is actually. Let's just move from cover to cover. This, by the way, is not how I'm gonna play <laughs> most of the game actually. But I know it's a tutorial level and I can't really use my. use the more stealthier approach here, I think. Okay. Let's keep moving. What? Okay, can I throw him? I can throw him around. That's good to know. Okay. Anyway, let's keep moving. Okay. Two more. Yeah, they, uh, yeah, not all of this game is gonna be this sort of hectic. It's just a tutorial level, so we have to teach some basic things. Oh, that's, yeah, that's in the corner. Okay, yeah. Good. No, there's nobody there, so... Are we still... Yeah, we, were, we are still crouched. Okay, that's fine. That is fine. Take cover. See what's happening. Nothing. Okay, keep moving. Power generator. That's the beautiful uh, skyline of shit. No, Detroit. I think it's De supposed to be Detroit. I can't remember. It's been a while. I'm pretty sure it's Detroit where we are right now. Could not. Could be something else. Okay, I need to take out these assholes. Ha! Headshot, motherfuckers! Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. In case you haven't noticed yet, this game is, has adult themes and I will be using adult language. I will be using words like fuck a lot when I play this. For example, where the fuck am I going? <laughs> here? No, here? Ah, door. That's a door. It is a door, yes. We have located the door. So there's nothing there. Okay, that's a save point, that's good. Oh, 
Oh, that's not good. Okay. Ah, shit. Oh, right. Of course, there's a box there. I didn't go in the door. Ah, okay. Save point. Auto saves are great. Fuck you. Okay, let's move a little bit. No, don't do that. That guy then let's move a little bit. Is that a dude in there? Where's the rest? Where's the last one? There! I can't get him, get to him from this angle, I don't think. Okay, wait, yes. Okay. Ha! Screw you, all of you. Okay, any more? No? Okay, good. Keep moving. This level is boring. I'm not at all representative of the game, actually. Just try to get through this in a re relatively quick manner. Let's just fucking walk. Oh, is that it? I think this might be... Oh! 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 That's gonna hurt. Super villains because that's how you get super villains. Jesus. Ow. That's not nice. CT probe shows the bullet cost severe hematoma. We need to repair that artery. So yeah, Adam Jensen did just take a bullet to the somewhere, I don't even know. Gotcha. It was a glass. But we survived. Bear it. Come on, Ed. Stay with us. Adam dies in surgery. Game over. Oops. Credits look really cool, so that helps. We can rebuild him. We have the technology. Music by Michael McCann. Michael McCann. Hey. So indeed, we are turning Adam into the. One million dollar man, or whatever the hell that show was called. <laughs> ah, cutscenes. Six months later.
Please don't call your surveillance cameras big brother. That's just tacky. Adam Jensen, half man, half robot. With the coolest fucking sunglasses ever. <laughs> Adam, it's David. You in the building? Just entered the lobby. Sorry to pull you out of sick leave so soon, but uh, we've got a situation. A break-in at our Milwaukee Junction factory. Meet me at the helipad. I have to see Pritchard first. Something's wrong with my retinal enhancement. Frank's on the second floor in the tech lab. Make it quick. People's lives are at stake. Meet with Pritchard. Why is David keeping the SWAT team open right away? I don't have time to Remember do the this. last attack? You can't compare them to. There's actually a lot of chatter in this game, and you can just listen to guys talk for a while. Technology lab, let's go. Here's the little asshole. About time. What happened? You get stuck in an air duct on the way over? Yeah, nice to see you too, Francis. Something's wrong with my retinal display. Can you fix it? If it's what I think it is, probably. Of course, it might still. <laughs> Looks like your left and right imaging processors weren't completely in sync. But don't worry, your sentinel health implant will kick in soon, repairing any damage that might have caused. Your retinal display should be fine now. Its recognition software won't be picking up hostiles yet, but you should be seeing radar and targeting reticules. Biomedical data too, if you're in pain. Right. We done here? Because Seraph is waiting for me at the helipad. I know. Radicals have broken into our manufacturing plant and taken hostages. Maybe this time you'll actually save people. If you got a problem with me, Pritchard, why don't you just say it and get it over with? Why no, Jensen? I don't have a problem with you. If anything, I blame myself. The mighty Pritchard blaming himself. <laughs> That's gotta be a first. I'm the one who told Sarif we needed a physical security team to protect us. If he'd read my report closely enough. Wait a second. Are you saying it was your idea to hire me? Not you, Jensen. I wanted Dynacore, Sharp Edge, or Bell Tower. All the top private security contractors were on my list, but Sarif wanted somebody in-house. And so did Dr. Reed. There's the dialogue options. Actually, let's just confront him. I suggest we leave Megan out of this. Why, Jensen? It's no secret how close the two of you were. And let's face it, you'd just been fired from SWAT for that massacre in Mexican town. No one was about to hire you. You really have to stop getting your news from those Pikus blogs, Francis. They only confuse you. The point is, if Sarif had listened to me, we wouldn't be having this conversation. But Megan, God love her, always did have Sarif's ear. Sarif's ear is going to be hearing a report about violence in the workplace if you keep this up. You really feel like continuing? Point taken. Okay, and we got some XP for that, which is always nice. Always very useful. Okay, where's the helipad? By the way, cameras here as well. Big Brother cameras. Big Brother brand cameras, alright. Yeah, cafeteria and helipad, just as I kind of almost remember. Adam, how close are you to the helipad? Almost there. Good. Because SWAT's about to turn this into a PR nightmare. Meet me in the chopper. I'll brief you as we go. So, let's get going. See what happens. Welcome back, Jensen. Didn't think we'd see you around here for a while yet. You know how it goes, Malik. Duty calls. Don't I know it. I was in my wingsuit halfway to the top of the Renaissance Center when I got the 911. But you? Six months is a hell of a short time to come back from the dead. You sure you're ready for this? Only one way to find out. Roger that. The boss is already on board, arguing with the DPD's tactical response team. They've got the plant surrounded, but Mr. Seraph wants you to go in first. Are you all set here? Because the sooner we take off, the better it will be for everyone. So apparently the <laughs> internal security force of Seraph Industries consists of, well, me. Luckily, of course, I am Adam Jensen, super badass. I'm ready. I'm ready. Great. Then let's get airborne. 
I really should not read those aloud. Card scene. If you can hear that, it's more sail, it's sort of squeaking kind of, kind of a lot as I move around. I told Farida to put us down on a roof. I don't want the crowd seeing you go in. Fine. As long as she pulls you up the minute I'm gone. So what am I looking at here? Who are these guys? Pro-human purists, or so they say. The same purists who've been firebombing limb clinics all over the country. You buy that? No, I don't think it's a coincidence they hit us today, only hours after he moved the Typhoon in for assembly line factory. The Typhoon? Megan's team was testing it the day that bastard... Who's on point for these guys? Adam. I know you and Megan were once... Who is on point for these guys? Goes by the name of Sanders. That's Sanders. him there. He's Zeke an augmented Sanders. Adam. So he can't be one of the mercs who attacked us. But he did know exactly how to get inside our plant. All right. So how do you want me to handle this? First priority is the Typhoon. I'm keeping SWAT out until you've secured it. As far as rules of engagement go, I'll defer to you. Lethal or non-lethal? Ah, this is actually a kind of a big choice here. Because one of the point, as you might know, one of the big selling points in Deus Ex games is the fact that you can actually choose how you do things. There's a wide variety of ways. So now you can you, you get you get a weapon after this one, depending on what you choose. You get either a lethal or non-lethal weapon. I'm gonna go with non-lethal here. It's my style usually in stealth games. I'm gonna be stealthy as long as I can, although I will murder a bitch if they <laughs> get in the way or spot me or something. But yeah, non-lethal. I'm not looking to start a firefight in there. Just neutralize them. Okay, but just make sure those bastards don't wake up and warn their friends. You remember what it's like in there? A lot of tight enclosed hallways, but the labs themselves are pretty open. High ceilings. So, do you want something you can use from a distance or up close? Dude. Ah, it's stun gun or tank rifle. Give me something with distance. If I get too close, I'll take them out personally. Just try not to break anything expensive. The Typhoon should be in the factory labs, and darts. but Pritchard will tell you more as you go in. I've got him running comms. Oh, Terrific. Anything else? Keep your eyes open for hostages. Free them if you can, but the Typhoon is your number one priority. We developed it for the Alphabet agencies, and if we don't deliver it to them intact and still a secret, well, I'm sure you'll get the job done right. Gentlemen, prepare for landing. Kind of a cool flying machine, actually. I don't know. It's kind of a hybrid between helicopter and planes. It looks like. It looks like a plane, but planes can't land, by the way. All right. Okay. Enter the plant. Secure the hostage. We have a tranquilized. Oh, for fuck's sake! You're just. Yeah, don't mind me just standing down here. Never mind, just you just go, I won't be burned around. <laughs> anyway, we have a trank. Let's see if I can see our inventory here. Yes. We have a trank rifle and nine darts. This is the sort of Tetris inventory. It will expand later, don't worry. Serif Industries. Okay, I wonder if there's anything interesting in here. Cardboard boxes, probably empty. Is that? That's. I don't even know. Let's throw a box at that guy. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh dear. Oh dear. Wow. <laughs> Okay. 
Let's try this again. Ah, he's a cop. Okay, so these are the SWAT guys who are just waiting. Look at this. They're sending in a can opener to do a man's job. Those purity first assholes are just gonna love this. Don't call me a can opener or you'll get a fucking cardboard box to the head as well. <laughs> okay, let's see. Menu is ever a tutorial. Oh, let's see. let's see. Cyber Boost Pro Energy Bar, that's good. Let's the first rule of all sort of adventure game is okay. Let's let's see this one. At any point during the game, you can access the in-game menu. The inventory holds all the items you are carrying with you. It has a fixed size, which can be upgraded through augmentation. You can move inventory items around, examine them, or combine them with upgrades. Yay! In the heat of battle, you can rely on the quick inventory instead. It allows you to oh. quickly equip a weapon or change grenade type. What's the button for that? The objective oh, screen fine, details your current missions and objectives. The log screen is a repository. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's the quick button? Okay, the arrow button stuff from D-pad. That's that thing. It's like, let's see, what could it be? What? Ah, here we go. It's Y key and then we can... We can quick select a cyber boost bar and we can, well, we can equip weapons, but we only have the trunk rifle. Okay, that's good, I think. Is there anything? Okay, this seems a little bit better, a little bit more stable. See if this causes a problem, we can always chase it back. Tell me you're the guy we've been twiddling our thumbs waiting for. SI security. Name's Jensen. Jensen, yeah, I thought I recognized you. Used to be on team two till that Mexican town thing went down. I gotta say, you're the last person I've pictured taking orders from a CEO. Things change. Not always for the better. Feel like getting in there and doing whatever it is your boss wants you to do? Because maybe then we can do our job. Why is your mouth orange to the inside? Intel on these purists. How much you got? How much you want? They communicate any demands yet? Not yet, but I get the feeling they're not that organized. Most of the guys I've seen look like street bangers and thugs. The kind who get their jollies trashing equipment. You ask me, is the man in charge you have to worry about? Seriously, what the hell is the orange thing inside your mouth? The leader's name is Sanders, right? What's his story? Zeke Sanders. We're running background on him now. Looks like he fought two tours in the Gulf. One of them on a recycle military bill. You mean he's augmented? Seraph told me he's not. He used to be augmented. Says his augs made him do evil shit, so he ripped him out. Now he's got a whole crew of gullible street kids listening to his crap and ready to die for him. Or kill. Okay. How many am I looking at down there? Hard to say. We've spotted three in the courtyard, maybe half a dozen inside. But that's a sketchy estimate at best. Since we seem to be getting a loop playback off your intellicams. That shouldn't be possible. I told Seraph to make sure Pritchard overhauled the system. Well, someone inside must be tech savvy, because all we're seeing is a loop. For all we know, there could be five, ten, or three dozen perps in there. Okay. I think I've heard enough. You sure? Wouldn't want to make your boss unhappy. We've got people inside. Any idea where I should look for them? Yeah. Your plant manager, Josie Thorpe, managed to slip a call out before someone snatched her cell. She said the hostages are being held in an office near the assembly labs. Makes sense. The workers were setting up for a production run, so they'd have been concentrated there. You'd know more about that than I would. Anything else? You look pretty dug in up here. What's the React team plan? We got Alpha as Point and Bravo as Wing, both standing by to breach the target. We're coordinating from here, but until your boss gives us the go-ahead, we're just holding our dicks. Realistically, how much time do I have before any shooting starts? According to protocol, none. According to your lawyers, the sooner you get in there, the sooner we can hose this powder keg down and call it a day. I love how the SWAT is just taking orders from a private business I got owner. it from here. Sit tight. 
Wait for Seraph's signal. Like we got a choice. Especially since it's my boss, so. Does this guy have anything to say? Fucking time. You know there are hostages in there, right? Yeah, fuck you too. That kind of talk will get you a cardboard box in the head. Anyway, let's check the lockers. Oh yes, what's this? Painkillers, that's good. That's always good. We can kill the pain. Okay. Jensen, it's me, Pritchard. Where are you? On a roof overlooking the plant. Good. Your point of entry should be through shipping and receiving. Should be, Francis. The hell does that mean? We have an employee entrance there. Heavily guarded by purists, no doubt. So, if you're not a fan of the frontal assault, I suppose you could try accessing the building's roof. Okay. So, after only 14 minutes of shit on this video, we're finally gonna get to some action, I think. Let's see, ladders. Also moving on to a third-person camera for a while there. That's nice. Where the f so where the f okay, I'm still on, I'm still on a roof. I'm on another roof here. This is a roof. Okay, there's nothing here. So we need to get to another roof, I think. Okay, I think we can do that. I think there will also be more tutorials pretty pretty soon. I assume. Yep, let's check this out. Getting too close to any guard is a risk. You're better off staying far away from them. Learn their patrols and time your moves accordingly. If you can avoid it, it's generally better not to engage them. Sure, a lone target may be tempting, but you never know. Backup might be right around the corner. If you have no other choice, try taking out your targets silently by moving up behind them and tapping the takedown button to put them to sleep. Killing them is a more permanent solution, but also involves making more noise. To do it, simply hold the takedown button. Whether you kill or stun, all takedowns burn up energy. If your energy bar is empty, you will not be able to use your augmentations. You can, however, replenish your energy cells through the consumption of nutrients. Okay, Regardless, don't leave bodies lying out in the open. If they are found, an alarm will be called in. So grab them and drag them out of the way. Alright. Are we done? Yes, we're done. Okay. No, that's the button. Let's... Yeah, everything seems under control. No sign of SWAT. No sign of anyone. Okay, here's our first customer of the evening. Let's get behind here and take cover. Okay, we can move on. You can see the minimap, it has these uh, white arrows that mean guards, so there's another one behind the corner there, I think. So this, this is the part where the tutorial actually took that guy out. Gonna try something else. Oh, for fuck's sake! Did I make noise? Still okay. Let's let's look at it. Stealthy video. hinges on sight and sound. Crouching down will assure you are making the least amount of noise possible. Line of sight is important, and by keeping behind cover, you'll stand a better chance that enemies won't detect oh, you. Oh, really? Wow. Avoid jumping and sprinting, as it will certainly Stop give away your position. Okay. Is that guy gonna move or not? I can't remember how to get get to where I'm going. Seriously, is that guy gonna just stand there? 
looks like it. How do I get past him? Can I just... Are you just gonna... For fuck's sake. Really? Really? Okay, let's... Ah! Oh, that arm's gonna hurt in the morning. And we have an achievement. So, now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take him far away from here. Hope the guy doesn't come around the corner there. Actually, something I'm noticing here is the, the energy bar. There's two bars. And apparently the two are auto... They're gonna auto-fill. Which I think is changed from the original version. Okay, what's this? Getting too close to any guard. No, we have that seen that. Yeah, there was. On, I think there was also two in the original version, but only one of them replenished automatically. So that's new. Let's see. We want. Yeah, we want to that, and we'll take all his money as well. Yes, I think he's he's out of the way. Yes, am I? Yeah, I'm crouching. All right, let's keep going. Ah, yeah, I see. That's the that's the way to the roof, I think. So, uh, while we're here, we're gonna see where the other guy is. Seriously? Yeah, he's somewhere in. Uh, no, not that button. A. Okay, so there's the next guard. Kind of far away, actually, so let's... Okay, go back here. Door. Okay, I think we're safe in here for a while. Also, by the way, let's... Um, yeah, there's the gun there. Let's take that one. It's 10 millimeter pistol. I don't... I hope I don't have to use it. Oh, yes! Stun gun darts. Except I don't... I think I have a stun gun. Whatever, still good. So I hope I don't have to use 9mm gun pistol here, but if I do have to, I will. Let's see this. Okay, there's nothing else here. So let's see about getting to the roof now. Yeah, I know there's a tutorial available that has been made clear. Fuck, can I climb? Nope. How do I get up there? Stop making noise. Okay, let's take this one. Right. Can... For fuck's sake. Can we climb this? Yes. Can get up here. Okay, are those guys gonna see me if I keep... Portable cover! Okay, for fuck's sake. Let's just get up here. Okay, I don't think they noticed me. That's, that is good, that is as it should be. Climb the ladder here. Alright. So... That, as we can see, is electricity. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna move this and we're gonna reveal the way. Which I kind of remember from my last playthrough. Okay, now then. Alright, that's... Breaker box. Okay, that was easy. Didn't have to hack into it or anything. Okay. Yeah, there's a doorway. We can just go through here. Oh, is that... There's guards inside there, actually. Oh, there's a buddy here. Why is there a buddy here? Oh, hello, silent sniper rifle. Yes. Let's see my inventory here a little bit. Oh, yeah. 
Hell yeah. Let's actually uh, examine. Military Spec Ops variant of the standard longsword eraser. Okay, what's the... Uh, do I have any ammo for it? Stun gun darts, that's remote. Detonated explosive device. Crank dart. I don't think I have ammo for that, actually. It's... Oh, I do have... It, it does come with five ammo. I'm still gonna go with the Trank rifle. That's until I know for sure who I'm gonna shoot. Let's uh, let's go Richard, here and nicely done, Jensen. May I ask how? A vent on the roof. It'll be in my report next time we discuss security loopholes. Oh, goody! I'll be sure to take notes. The Typhoon is in the factoring labs. There's an elevator just past the assembly lab that will take you to it. Got it. Okay, we are in the building. I'm gonna be cautious here. I'm just gonna save the game here. Okay. I don't see anyone here. Trank darts, thank you. I still kind of actually, um, I'm still not on the ground floor. Okay. If we can take the ladder here. Let's see. Go down. Okay, there's an I mean, sort of an office here. Oh, yeah, computers. Let's. Feel we've got more problems with the line in 9 after Rick is down. I don't want to be the one to hold a production. Okay. So the guy over now with the cover. There are no timestamps here. I don't know what the order of this shit is. Current increase will last only two more weeks. Blah blah blah. Nothing interesting there. There are occasionally some very interesting stuff on the computers here actually. Ooh, there's an ebook. Resist the machine. We are purity first. Reject the metal. There's a lot of these things here. I'm not gonna read all of them. This is apparently propaganda by the purity first guys. It's also newspaper. Bikers Daily Standard. Die Young Medical continues. Can the motor see to rise again? Yeah, we are in Detroit actually. That is. That is as I thought on the last video. I'm not sure. I think I get. XP maybe for reading some of the stuff, or at least like you know looking at them, having, having, having Adam look at them. Hello, rifle ammo and revolver ammo. Okay, good. So let's let's be extra cautious. I'm gonna just overwrite that save since nothing happened yet, and see. We'll see what. Okay, for fuck's sake. Wow! Wow! That was yeah. That's just... okay. Let's. <laughs> so opening the door is not a good idea, apparently. Is there a? Okay. Let's just. Let me just see if I go back up here for a bit. Okay, there's a dude in there. No? Can I, uh, let's see. Drunk rifle. I wonder if I should try to make my way up to up here somehow instead. Actually, <laughs> wait. Is it just me, or is this a really dumb way to go about this? <laughs> it may not be. Let's... How far can I actually go like this? Okay, there's a couple guys there. Should I take these guys out? Oh, wow. Hmm. 
It's taking these guys a while to actually kill me, but let's... Let's not even let them. So, actually there's a way to probably see what's going on here. So now if I open the door, I can go here, right? Yes. Good. Okay. And damn, there's a lot of guys there. I seem to remember there was actually a way to... Oh, hello. <laughs> that's, that's necessary. Okay, what's this? This is a double barrel shotgun and this. More explosives. Let's just take everything. For fuck's sake. Let's take everything we can carry. Okay, I can't take whatever that... Ah, there we go. Shotgun cartridges. That was unnecessarily difficult. Okay, what is this place? I don't even know. There's probably somebody in there. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna save the game before we go through the door. No, not that. Let's just make a new save. Who cares? I have a space. Oh no, I... What the fuck's that? Can't you hit me now? <laughs> Yeah, that's not, this is not gonna happen. Not gonna happen. So we're, wait a minute. Orientation, okay, yeah, great. Okay, something we missed here. Let's say, con your inventory is full already? Really? What? No, holy shit, we have a lot of stuff here. Okay, what, can I, like, ah, uh, quest items are separate. Can I know I can't combine those? Wait a minute. Okay, combat rifle ammo. That is definitely something I won't need. Drop that. What else? Stun gun. Revolver ammo. I don't need that. And what's that? That's shotgun. Okay. So there we go. We just dropped some shit there so we can take the grenade instead. Let's see how much space that. Okay, that doesn't take a lot of space at all. Okay, let's see now. So, here. Yes. Actually. If I go here. Okay, let's wait for that guy to go turn back. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is completely unnecessary, by the way, but I want to go through the window. <laughs> Turn around! And I can't do it. Okay, great. So let's just... Okay. And we can go here. Yes. I like the third person view a lot more. I hope that guy doesn't see me. Oh crap. That, I don't think that counts as making noise in this game. Let's see, I think I can, yes. Okay, here's one guy. Okay, that guy is looking this way now. Wait for him to turn around. Turn around. <laughs> this is what stealth games are like, really. Okay, now that let's see, it's gonna be a little bit trickier, I think. Can I just take this? Yes, thank you. Jesus Christ, these sound like they make a lot of noise. I don't think they actually do. Okay. Get to the ladder. 
down. Okay, I don't see anybody on this level. Which is nice. Which is nice. I realize I don't have to start whispering to the microphone just because I'm being stealthy in the game. Or do I? Wait a minute, where the fuck am I going? Yes, I can move boxes around, that will not be very helpful. Is there something here that I can use? No, what the fuck? There's something here. Trank yards. Nice. No, but seriously, where the fuck am I going now? Oh, hello. That's that's what I was looking for. Slight problem here. Let's get a box. Reusable container. Do not destroy. I don't think you can actually destroy this. I don't usually have a chance to try that since that would make noise. No. Yes, okay, that's the way to do it. Then we're gonna be neat and close the vent behind us so nobody knows we're here. Yes, we are making progress. What the hell? Left left or right? Let's see. What's anybody see D Rad? Probably smoking a cigarette. Why? Cigarweed? Us all on full alert. What for? The popos ain't coming in here. Not while we's holding on the cars. No shit. Huh. That's a drop. I don't necessarily want to take that drop just yet. I have to wanna see what's this one sort of way I ha I didn't take this way yet. Also, I would appreciate if my frame rate didn't start tanking. And there's another drop here. Great. Okay. We don't have to go to the menu every time. And I'm in a closet. Insert gay choke here. Doesn't seem to be anything useful here. I love this. There's this sort of. When there's doors, you can always look through, see through them a little bit. There's a guy somewhere in there, but... Huh. Oh shit. So you're gonna see the door? Holy shit. Okay. Turn around. Oh, oh, that's that's nasty. It's not a guy, but I don't see is he in this room or the next. Okay, I think he's somewhere in there, maybe. Anyway, the thing to do in, in a place like this is <laughs> beer. Is to see all the lockers that I can open. Let's just stand up for a while. Oh, there's somebody behind that. There is another door there. Let's hope they don't come this way. Aha! Uh -huh. Yes, revolver ammo. I don't need that. We have to... We can't just take everything. <laughs> as much as I'd like to. That guy's holding nothing. Wait, is that a gun there? No pistol there. I think I have a pistol as well already, so... So yeah, as I was saying, you can't just take everything, because we'll run out of inventory space as we already did once. So only take the shit we can actually use. Is there a trash can here? Let's put that out of the way. We are very neat. Ooh. 
stun gun darts. That's always good. Holy shit, there's a lot of lockers here. Money! Also, you can see there are lock locker brand lockers. Locker, the best name for lockers since whatever. <laughs> this is a, truly an exciting thing. Yes, drunk darts, okay. The grenade will take that if we can fit it, and I think we can. And uh, one more wall of these. Right, I don't have a combat rifle, I don't think so. So yeah, the game does actually provide the sort of this ammo you can find for a lot of different weapons. There's obviously there were different weapons you could have chosen in the beginning when you were in the helicopter, so Okay, let's see. I think there's actually a guy who might this might not be a good idea. Just yeah, because that guy's gonna come and patrol over here. Let's see. I don't have very good augments yet, so I can only sort of use the minimap to see what that guy's doing. Then I can see if I can see him through the door. I'll take a drink while I do that. But yeah, we'll wait until that guy goes around the corner there. Which he has done, I think, about now. Close the door. Jensen, I just tried to unlock the assembly lab door, but my override codes aren't working. Someone's changed the protocols. What? Didn't you plug the... I'm on it. But until I find this particular breach and fix it, you'll have to hack the door manually. Pritchard out. Okay. Thank you, Pritchard. You prick. Decontamination. Hacking tutorial, okay, let's watch when that hacking, one. your goal is to take control of a device's registries so you can access the security codes within. To do it, you must navigate the network, capturing nodes as you go along. You begin a hack from your point of entry in the system, the I.O. port. To capture a node, simply place the cursor over it and hold the interaction button. A wheel will appear, showing you the... Actually, I think I know how to do that. I kind of remember that was a big part of the game already, so let's see. No code found, so we're gonna hack this seat. Five attempts left. Okay, so we are gonna go we are trying to get to the green. We're starting here, so let's Okay, we can Okay, no, we already have that one, so just we're gonna capture this one and then I think they might start a trace as soon as we do that. Or maybe not. And then we're gonna capture this one. Access granted. That was disappointingly easy. But yeah, we're gonna go to the contamination. Decontamination. Not contamination. What the fuck is that? And so, this is the end of the first episode. Next time we'll go after Mr. Sanders for real and finish this first mission. You may have noticed all those little dissolve effects, those were all either loading screens or times I messed with the settings. No actual gameplay was cut however. Until next time, this is the fan, signing off.